What's up, y'all? It's your boy G in Honolulu, Hawaii, doing a church cleaning today. And uh, it's a small church. Uh, we do this twice a week, uh, two hours each time we clean. We got two people on this one today, but uh, we normally just put one person. Uh, but we want to get out of here a little earlier, so we've got two people on the job today. Uh, light work, so yeah, we'll do the floors, we'll do the bathrooms, there's about four bathrooms, and uh, the main sanctuary, and then the stage, and then that's pretty much it. Take out the trash, and we're good to go. All right, you guys, check you out later. Guys, I don't know if you caught that or not, but I said bathroom, I meant restrooms. Bathrooms are in residences. Restrooms are in businesses. Big difference. All right, guys, just as expected, we've been tasked with the responsibility of distributing this to the community. down here too and of course I will be more than happy to meet that responsibility and get it out to those that need it just what comes with the job happy to do it though amen yes yeah, so a lot of churches are opening to full capacity these days. They're trying to cut costs with housekeeping while providing their congregation with the cleanest environment. And uh, so churches don't spend a whole lot of money. But uh, I went to this church with my first proposal and they declined it. They said it was too much money. And so we had to go back to the table and I sent them a second one, which was much cheaper. And they were able to do that. Um, but before I sent them that, I had to ask myself, have I been blessed? And the answer is a resounding yes. So I do eight toilets, two urinals, six sinks, 10 trash bins, a main sanctuary and a stage, all for the price of two large pizzas. And I'm blessed doing it. All right, y'all, it's your boy G. I'm out of here. Be entirely blessed and I'll holler at y'all later. Aloha.